Hello, it's the IT Guys 99 here, and welcome back to Microsoft PowerPoint 2016. Today we're going to be looking at our top 10 keyboard shortcuts in PowerPoint. So let us begin. In at number 10 we have the Find keyboard shortcut. To use this shortcut, hold down Control on the keyboard, and then press F. Find will appear, and this will let us search for something in our presentation. I'm going to search for the word element. Then, when you click Find Next, it'll take you to where the word element is written in your presentation. In at number 9 is saving the presentation. To save your presentation, hold down Control on your keyboard and then press S. This will save your presentation quickly if you already have, or it'll open the Save As menu if you haven't saved your presentation already. In at number 8, we have the ability to move objects using our arrow keys. I have this image of a turtle selected. So now, if I press my arrow keys, I can move it up or down with lots of control. If I want more control, I can hold down control whilst doing this, and it will make it move by even smaller amounts. In at number 7 is the ability to open headers and footers with your keyboard. To do this, hold down Alt, then press Shift and D, and it'll open the header and footer dialog box. If you haven't already seen it, go check out our tutorial on how to use headers and footers in Microsoft PowerPoint 2016. In at number 6 is a new keyboard shortcut for 2016. This is when you press Alt and Q, and they'll open Cortana for you. In at number 5 is the ability to copy and paste quickly. Conventionally, you'd either right click and click copy to copy, or you'd use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl C. However, in PowerPoint, there's a new quick feature. You hold down Ctrl on your keyboard, and then drag on the objects you want to copy, it'll create a copy of that object for you. In at number 4 is the ability to toggle grid lines. To toggle grid lines, hold down Shift on your keyboard and then press F9. Grid lines will turn on. To turn them off again, hold down Shift and press F9. Grid lines are a great way to make sure everything is all lined up so it looks professional while creating your presentations. In at number 3 is the ability to duplicate a slide. To duplicate a slide, hold down Control and press D. It will duplicate the slide for you. In at number 2 is the ability to insert a new slide. To insert a new slide, hold down Control and press M. It will create a new slide for you. And finally, in at number 1 is the ability to start and stop your presentations using the keyboard. To start your presentation from the beginning, press F5. It will start your presentation from the beginning. Press Escape to leave your presentation. To start your presentation from the current slide, hold down Shift on your keyboard and then press F5, and it will start your presentation from your current slide. Thank you very much for watching. That's all we've got to show you in this tutorial, but make sure you check out the rest of our tutorials on using PowerPoint 2060. Also, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like and a comment. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye.